Hi everyone, welcome back to Crochet Rocks. Tracy here and <clears throat> I've got some yarn delivery to show you. Now I ordered some restocks for uh, Stylecraft and I decided to get some new yarn as well while I was there. So this one, uh, with summer in mind, it's freezing outside so at least it's sunny. But it starts to make you think we've got Christmas out of the way and we we'll start thinking about what we're going to make. So I bought some natural organic cotton and um, let me get my neck light I'll actually put it on it's getting a bit dim I think I need to put batteries in it maybe I'll just do one side I don't want to blind you if I move so this is the natural organic cotton and uh, let's have a look can I see it without opening it up we have natural organic cotton in the color of storm there are 10 in here and they are 50 grams and I've had this on a sample before. Felt like I was going to sneeze then, guys, didn't? Um, but one may be brewing. I'm not sure if I can get this. I'll get another colour out. It might be easier to see. This one is beautiful. This is a really gorgeous colour. Look at that. This one is called Coral. And I did order a couple of these because I know I want to make something with it. So um, I ordered some for me, basically. Can never really pass it by. So here we go. Let's get them out. These are absolutely adorable little balls. Look at that. Aren't they cute? And they feel lovely and soft. And it's organic, so that's good. We're doing the environment a favour. A naturals, organic cotton... Um, natural yarn from Stylecraft, approximately 105 metres, 115 yards, and they are, I think, DK weight. Trying to find all of the information when I'm not familiar with the yarn band, which is brilliant, isn't it? Now, it doesn't actually say, how about that? Somewhere, I'm trying to find it. You can iron it. I'll show you all the info because you probably see those symbols far better than I could. I know you will tell you what. I actually got them ready. <laughs> I need glasses. Look at that. Wow, you never know. I might see something now. Okay, so I've, sort of, I've shown you the yards and the, the meters. And it is coral. There's a number. We have cool tumble dryer, cool iron. You may dry clean it and oh I don't know what it says machine washable at 30 degrees organic cotton and absolutely nothing that says whether it's DK but I think it is it could be look at that there's the strand it's not the fattest but cotton does well it does seem thinner when you use it isn't it beautiful I like the night I like coral so that's storm and coral so far this one, this is pretty. This one's called papaya. And I love that colour. I got these because I thought they would go really well on a project together. So that's papaya. All the same info, obviously. And then this one, look at that lovely green. Isn't it pretty and quite vibrant? This one is called leaf. I like that one usually greens are very sagey or minty but I really like that one that's pretty I don't think I'm gonna like get a landslide of yarn soon oh this one's called peppermint but look at that isn't it just beautiful that's lovely so if I hold these a little bit further back it's so that's that really like teal really isn't it peppermint my eye Okay, and then we've got red, which is called poppy. Got a little bit of poppy. I didn't really have a great deal. Sorry if I blinded you then. I didn't really have a great deal of cotton yarn in my store, um, which is hobbyrocks.co.uk if you haven't heard of it, which I'm sure you have. Um, but I did have the, the cotton silky one called Cotton Smooth by King Cole. But it, other than that, the Cheney cotton cakes and t-shirt yarn, I didn't have a lot of cotton, so I wanted to sort of get some more. And every time I bought from Stylecraft and I was looking through the range, I kept 
coveting this, thinking I really need to get that in my life. And it was never the right time to order it. You know, it was always winter or something. So this time I thought I'll get ahead of the game and I will pop in and order. And there's this one. This is called Buttermilk. It is a really rich colour. It's really lovely and soft. It, the condensation, because this has been out in the cold, just come off the van. And the condensation on these packs, I can feel it. Kind of feel it because we're now in the warm. But that's Buttermilk. I like that one. And that with a, some of those other colours as well. I'm going to get a landslide. I know it. What else have we got? Uh, oh, look at that one. Isn't that beautiful? This is called mauve. I don't think mauve does that justice. I know it is mauve, but wow, you know, it's so much more than just mauve. I wouldn't have called that mauve. Um, fondant. Now, in Stolkoff, they have a lot of fondant, so I knew what that was going to look like, but it is a lovely pink. We have to start a new line, or we will, we will, like, you know, drown under a pile of... This one's called Deep Sea. Deep Sea is a beautiful blue. You know I love blues anyway. I'm a bit of a sucker for blue. But yeah, this is a beautiful one. And I wanted to make something this summer. I did allude to it last year where I wanted to box in with a blind um, in the bathroom where the, the cylinder is, the, the water cylinder. And um, I wanted to do something kind of nautical because it's a bathroom and I do have lighthouses and beach huts in there so I wanted to get something kind of of a nautical feel but the colours I had were just a bit too wishy-washy but these are stunning so then we have this one which is a silver and it's called dove the dove from above isn't that lovely dove is pretty I'm sorry if you are disappointed with me not getting all these out, but I want to keep them intact as much as I can, the ones that I'm going to put in the shop, because it's hard for me if they start falling out. But you can see really well through this. This is sea green. That's a beautiful colour, and that's going to feature in my blinds, I can tell you. Okay, any more? Yep. Good God, I didn't realise I wanted so many. But I did. This one is called Amethyst, and believe it, Amethyst is my birthstone colour, so I like that one. That is beautiful. It's very much the colour, really, of Hobby Rocks. Um, pinks and magenta and that kind of colour is the colour of Hobby Rocks. So, this one is a very light, it's called Moonlight. Uh, I really like this one. It's kind of the hintiest of blues. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's almost a blue-white beautiful absolutely stunning so yeah i like that one a lot and there's, there's more oh my god i knew i wanted to order a lot of this but i think i went crazy this is called faded denim so if you put them side by side it is a lot lighter but they're both very light but I, these will really graduate very very well in colors when you're trying to sort of ombre or graduate colors beautiful and just gorgeous blue lagoon again see what i'm doing with those colors there i absolutely love the blues as you know right i've got to dive in i think this is a black one it's called iron iron that's a strange name is it iron i think it's black it looks black to me i'm sure i ordered black and white which I cannot see. Maybe they're out of stock of white at the moment. This is Azure, again, another blue. I did have a lot of pinks and corals, so I know I got a lot of blues, but you know, that's just, <laughs> I'm gonna die, I'm gonna just get a landslide. Right, so then I did some restocking of the special Aaron because it's very low on silver. Because I've sold a lot of color packs, um, what I did with the special Aaron was um i made some yarn bundles for my shop which are cheaper i mean it's cheap anyway the stylecraft special aaron um really cheap as well as the special dk and all their special ones are cheap 
so but they're lovely and soft they're really really nice yarn so what i did i did some color packs and they're even cheaper to buy if you add them all together so um i was very short of the the pastel ones so this is silver it is absolutely lovely lovely i sold out of that because it is so nice and this is wisteria i believe yep wisteria i was also very very low on wisteria and then i don't know why so they obviously out of stock i was very low on fondant so i got replacements for that so that somebody just attacked me that was all i got say all i got it's a gigantic box and there's quite a lot in there let's turn that light off so it doesn't come back to um blind you guys so there we go that's that's my order i don't know um i thought i'd ordered some other yarn but maybe it's the signet that i was going to order that was the one i'm thinking of but i know i i wanted to get this naturals for a long long time it is really 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 lovely and um there's one that i got out but it is beautiful and i love these little balls they're just absolutely adorable but soft and really really nice now the king cole cotton smooth has a silk feel so this is soft you could wear this no problem at all um the other one oh, it's just <laughs> the other one is is beautiful but the colors are not there so that's my little yarn haul i hope you like that give me a while to upload it to the shop <laughs> it's going to take me a while to uh it's just one range but i have to get do a lot to get that put on obviously the restocks i can do really really quickly i'll just add the numbers but those are going to take a little while but thank you for watching um which one's your favorite tell me um i really all of those blues i mean there are many with the grays i mean it really stunning but i do want to do this blind with maybe put lighthouse um a life life saver ring um maybe a beach hut or two in the design of it so all of those colors will get used in that and maybe some of the other cotton that i had uh, some of the cotton smooth if i need different colors but i think this range of colors really does beat that one um starcraft yarns are beautiful anyway but they'll become one of my favorite yarns actually but anyway thanks for watching Give me time to upload that if you want it and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.